If you don't know how to value yourself in the marketplace, you're going to be lowballed. If you don't know how to value yourself in the marketplace, you're going to struggle. Mm -hmm. You really, really, really are. And I think that's the piece that people don't tell us. We think that in order for us to excel, we have to be at the top of our game. Mm -hmm. We have to be the best. We have to be able to show everybody we can do it bigger, bolder, and better. And we think that that's tied to the technical part of it, right? So we go to school, we get certified. You know, we, we go and get all these, these things that we think are going to justify or bolster mm -hmm. what we have so we compete. We can compete in the marketplace, right? Mm -hmm. But the thing about it is if you bring a work for somebody else mentality in the marketplace, it's not going to work. You're going to get eaten alive. And many of us put more money and investment in the technical aspect, making sure our stuff is pristine, making sure our stuff works, right? right? Getting the extra degrees. I mean, as black women, we got degrees out the wazoo. You know, we got right. certifications out the wazoo. We got continued education out the wazoo. We're the best of the best of the best of the best. And we every time we come up upon a, a hurdle or a challenge, I, I, I know I need to get me another degree. <laughs> <laughs> because we've been conditioned mm -hmm. to think that way. Right. But it's that conditioned thinking that causes us not to really be successful in the marketplace. Because if you don't believe in the value that you bring, people gonna always challenge you. Mm 